Do your job. This video is brought to you by True Honor. GoDaddy.com. Enter code HUB749 for a discount off a domain name. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies hit the floor. Let the bodies. Dustin Delatore with FightHubTV.com with Alexander Gustafson, a light heavyweight for UFC. You have uh, UFC 133 coming up. You take on Matt Hamill. Uh, what are your thoughts on Matt as a fighter? Matt is a good fighter. Uh, he's a he's a experienced fighter. Been in the UFC for a long time and be a great great test for me. A great step. Uh, no, I'm, I'm focused on the whole game, MMA game. I have a game plan, and that's my main focus. And uh, I'm, I'm training like boxing, Thai boxing, MMA, wrestling, Jiu Jitsu, everything here. So. Um, you had a few guys fall out of their fights on the main event and the co main event. And uh, word was that you were next in line to uh, maybe co main event the fight. What were your thoughts about that? I take any fight the UFC gives me, so I'm I'm just I just loves to fight, and I will be I will I wouldn't be be ready, so so I fight whoever the UFC put in front of me. So. You fought uh, Bill Davis before, right? Correct. Your teammate. Correct. Is there any uh, not any animosity, but any ribbing that goes around in the gym? I know you guys are training partners. Does he ever give you a hard time? No, he's uh, he's my that's my brother now. So we're we're training we're training good and yeah, he gives me a hard time in practice. He's a tough guy. You know, I learn a lot from him and uh, yeah, it's uh, we're good friends and good training partners. You're uh, you're from Sweden. You come out here to San Diego to train. Uh, talk about that. Talk about being back home and you fly over here to the United States to San Diego specifically and you train. Can you let us uh, know how that works out for you. Uh, yeah, I have my, I have my, my, my head coaches Andreas Michael from Sweden and uh, Eric Del Fiero here in San Diego. So, and uh, what I do is I train full time back home, back with Andreas Michael, and uh, he plans all my my training. And you know, I'm tr I'm training full time, but when it comes closer to the fight, I travel back oh, overseas to here to San Diego and train with uh, with uh, Eric Del Fiero and. Uh, do my last preparations here. It's a lot, it's more, uh, a lot more sparring partners, and you know, it's, yeah, it's a, uh, it's, it's good sparring here. Obviously, you've trained in Europe and you've trained here in the United States. Uh, I don't want to say Europe's European MMA is behind American MMA, but what are the big differences besides the sparring partners? Uh, I mean, if you could take anything from the United States and take it to Europe, to Sweden specifically, what would you do to help out your MMA uh, community out there in Sweden? Uh, you know, everyone is so so professional over here. It's like th this is what they do full time. So I will say I'm, I will say the the, US, the the MMA here in the US is is a little bit like in front of the, the European MMA. Uh, so it's uh, yeah. What can I say? It's uh, I, I would say it's you're like a, a few steps in front of us all the time. So yeah. Well, eventually, hopefully, Europe. Uh and, uh, yeah, yeah, I hope so. I hope so. Hopefully, you'll be leading the way. Yeah, I hope so. Um, I want to thank you for taking the time to thank you. Fight Hub to do this interview. Uh, do you want to thank any of your uh, fans back home, maybe in your native language? Yeah, yeah. No, I can thank all my on on English. I can thank all my fans, my my that supports me. Check my website, themall.com. I want to thank uh, like uh, Eric Delfiero, Team Alliance here to help me train and, and spar and you know have a good preparations. Good luck in UFC 133 against Matt Thanks very much.